Alam yakul lahu kufanad. There is nothing like him. Today's message is very loveful message, with due respect to all, with honor. We are going to learn something very important about Islam. You have just heard the statement of Zakir Naik, and that is based on Islamic theology. What we always hear from our Muslim brothers and sisters that Allah is one, and there is nothing like Him, which means no example. And then we are going to hear. From Sheikh Uthman ibn Farooq, Sheikhi Bhutan of Balor Park, San Diego, Imam of Masjid Al Ribat, we are going to hear a claim from this monkey, a monkey. Who got a matchbox from somewhere and has lit his own house of Islam, has burned his whole Islamic theology, his own Islamic theology. He got this lighter from somewhere, this monkey. He got some from somewhere this matchbox, and. He has given an example of Allah, the likeness of Allah. We are going to hear that claim from Sheikh Uthman ibn Farooq, and then we are going to see that is that claim is true, his statement is true, or what Zakir Naik is saying. That statement is true, and then we are going to elaborate it. We are going to learn something good out of it, and we are going to teach something good out of it. For example, right? If you look at a tree, right? A tree is one. If a tree has has leaves and fruits and all of that, that doesn't mean that the tree is more than one. This was a bad, bad, bad example from bad ass Sheikh Uthman ibn Farooq, who is Abu Jahl, Al Ghustaq, Al Khwarij, out of Islam. After giving this example, he is out of Islam because he is telling us that. His creator is like creation. Yes, this is very bad example, very bad likeness of Allah, the Islamic God. Because trees, they grow from seed to plant and plant to tree, and they get old and die. This was a bad example. If he believes Allah also is the same, he. He grows, and he gets old, and he is going to die, or he is dead. If his Allah is dead, then this example is good. And we know that trees they reproduce, they give birth, they do sex. If he believes that Allah is same like tree, then he has to believe that too. Trees they do. Sex through pollen, and they are male and female. There are many trees, and they have babies like flowers, fruits, leaves. So it means Allah has babies too. Allah has a family too. If tree is example of Allah, and we know according to Quran and Sahih Hadith, Allah has a family too. Hubal, the big brother. Ar-Rahman, the big brother, God 
of Quraysh, Uzalat Malat, Uzalat Manat, the daughters of Allah. And then we know Allah has a granddaughter, Pussy Blackstone, Hajarai Aswad, hanging on the welcome gate of his house, Kaaba. So if that is example of Allah, the likeness of Allah, the tree, then definitely it proves that Allah has a family. And trees, trees have parts, branches, roots, leaves. And these are all parts. And they, they die, yes. Which means Allah also has parts, face, finger, leg, hands. And death is certain for Allah. And then this Shaykh Uthman ibn Farooq said, Trees are the example. Tree is the example and likeness of Allah. Then that is a bad example, bad likeness for Islam because trees are dependent on other human beings to carry, to cut. And trees, they eat and drink. So they are dependent on other things. And they, trees, they do excrete. Which means they do poo poo and pee pee. They need pota potty. So Allah needs to do a call of nature according to the example and likeness of tree. And Allah needs a sunlight to survive. So if that is example given by a Muslim Imam of Masjid al Ribat, then this is a bad example. And trees we know, trees, they have girlfriends. So that is why Allah is demanding sahiba in Quran, girlfriend in Quran, to reproduce, to do a bang bang with that sahiba. Now we need to come to the conclusion. Yes, we need to come to the bottom line. And that is this monkey, Uthman ibn Farooq. Sheikh Uthman ibn Farooq, the monkey, he tried to play a trick. And Allah played a trick too. Because Allah is the best of the tricksters. So Allah has played a trick. And in his Quran, what we have just heard that for the false God, Allah of Quran, they can give an example of creation. Then why not true God who is becoming a flesh, a man, we can see that. And that with a trick, Allah has already mentioned in Quran 345 that the word of God is becoming flesh. The word of God is becoming Messiah. The one who is hidden now is evident. And he is honored in this world and hereafter. Before birth, Jesus is eternal and creator as the word of God, according to Quran 345. So Sheikh Uthman ibn Farooq tried to play a trick to hide this truth, but Allah played a trick too, because Allah is the best of the tricksters, the planner, the deceiver. So there is a truth and my Muslim brothers and sisters, you need to come to that truth. And this verse, Quran 345, is taken from the Holy Bible. John 1, 1, 2, 3 and John 1, 14. If you read that, you can come to this conclusion, to this bottom line, to this truth. In the beginning was the word and word was with God and the word was God. He was in the beginning with God. All things were made through him. And without him, nothing was made.
that was made. This is the best example. This is not an just example, but a truth that God, his word is becoming flesh. That is the kind of birth which is called incarnation. John 1.14, and the word was made flesh and dwelt among us. And we beheld his glory, the glory as of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. To accept this truth, Lord bless you. Amen.